So here are seven part-time online jobs that you would actually enjoy doing and how complete beginners are using these to make $100 a day to $5,000 a month with no experience. More with that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Fasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, to remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for it in the link below. We literally have a 62-year-old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days, so check it out now. So I have a little sister that lives in Thailand, and a couple months ago, she actually ended up calling me just crying, just ah! Uh, worried about the fact that her business wasn't succeeding as much as she wanted to and she was overwhelmed with what I ended up doing because you know you could see that I went from zero to eight thousand dollars in 30 days another one I went from zero to five grand in 30 days to 1.6 million that first year and another one we pull in anywhere from 35 grand to 46 grand a month and in her point of view she was just kind of like completely overwhelmed because number one she was comparing herself to her older brother and number two all the things that I was personally doing was things that she did deeply deep inside hated doing and she didn't want to continue you know for example traveling but doing things that she did not enjoy doing she found it stressful she found it taking away her energy she found it not enjoyable at all which got me thinking okay well if she feels that there's probably like a lot of people that watch YouTube videos that watch content that probably feel the same thing you know they see all the ways that people are doing things online and online jobs that they do not like doing but yet deep down they know that they would not enjoy doing it so I wanted to see myself, I was like, okay, well, if I was gonna go ahead and recommend you know, certain online jobs to people that would actually enjoy doing this, like how I recommended it to my sister, where would I actually begin? Well, before we actually begin with any of the seven online jobs that you would actually enjoy, you need to first begin one crucial, important question, and that's finding out what is your ikigai or akagi, whatever you wanna go and pronounce it. Right, because this alone will be the secret in what you would allow yourself to enjoy doing and what you would completely deep down hate. Because the problem with most people, as you can see in the icky guy, is people usually go into an online job that only intersects around here, profession, what you are good at or what you can get good at or what you can be paid for. Now the problem with most people is when they get stuck in this you know, profession, they end up making money but they hate their life. It's kind of like when my entire family was like, Mike, you have to become a dentist when you grow up because you're either a doctor, dentist, lawyer, or a nurse, or we, we won't feed you, right? Because I'm Asian, obviously. Uh, and, and I was like, okay, let me go and do this profession and, and thinking, oh, maybe when I make six figures and I open up a successful practice in the future, after I graduate dental school, then maybe you know my family will love me. Had I gone and chased that route, I would have hated my life. But yet, that's how people choose online jobs. They're like, oh, well, what's something that I could get paid for and what I'm actually good at? When what they need to start asking is the perfect online job that they would enjoy is what centers around what they love doing, what the world's needs, what you get paid for, and what you're good at. And when you start asking yourself certain questions, you know, like my sister did, she ended up finding the thing that she loves to do, her icky guy. She loves, for example, designing and graphic design and, and creative work. She knows that businesses need that. Uh, she knows that, well, if businesses need that and she could get paid for it and she likes working with like health and wellness people um, where she could also like become friends with them and network with them and have them as their mentors, then, you know, she'll do that as well as like she's really good at it. And now, you know, she's making good money, she's getting clients and she, she has finally found that. So before I even just give you these seven part-time online jobs, you gotta understand that if you really wanna enjoy it, you need to find out well, what, what is the intersection of all of these, and I'm gonna give you an example of all of them, right? So for me, right, I have, I, I enjoy talking to people, right? As you can see on my podcast, uh, this 11-year-old girl turned on $30 million, this guy that makes a million dollars from a profit, all these other people that I've interviewed here in Bali, right? So if you see this and you're like, well, that's great for you, Mike, but I can never meet those people. I can never go ahead and, for example, build that connection. Well, one good online job that you could do part-time is literally like a professional podcast editor and producer. You see people in Ukraine and uh, Colombia do this, $25 an hour, $20 an hour, has earned over 40 grand and has earned over 80 grand. Now this is on the lower end of the spectrum, but what it does pay you in is network. Right, Because if you think about it, these people that are editing these podcasts, they're meeting people who are literally like high net worth individuals that have a good network, that are really, really, you know, for example, popular in their niches. And if they build a connection and a network with them, 
they can learn from them indirectly. That's kind of what happened to me when I started networking with all these people. I learned indirectly, but you could have the exact same thing by doing an online job by just you know networking with those you know podcast people by just actually creating a service. Does that make sense? A second one that, that does really well is Google Ads. As you can see, Google Ads, this guy makes $105 an hour. He's earned over a million dollars. And you can actually learn Google Ads for free by just going to skillshop.withgoogle.com. Going to, for example, Google Ads right here. And as you can see, just going out and getting Google Ads certified for free. And you can see all of these things that ended up happening, two hours, uh, curriculum, here's a three hour curriculum, here's a 4.7 hour curriculum, here's another four hour cu curriculum, here's another three hour curriculum. All this is free that you can literally learn on how to run Google Ads. And the reason why it's so important is because like I said, like I pay someone to run my Google Ads, $4,000 a month. $4,000 a month and they have multiple clients. So you can see exactly how lucrative that is, okay? Now the third one is like Google Ads, but running Facebook ads. As you can see, this guy, uh, Guillen, has earned over 30 grand and earns $97 an hour. And Facebook ads, like same with Google Ads, is most businesses are moving online. And because of that, a lot of people have products that they wanna sell online, right? Uh, but a lot of them don't know how to run Facebook ads or Google ads. So one thing that I really enjoy doing are any one of these marketing jobs because not only do you not have to have any product, but you get a network with successful business owners that are willing to pay you know, a marketing manager to go ahead and run their ads. This is something my sister did. This is something I did. You know, Even like for example, every week, like uh, I end up talking to my Google ads manager and my Facebook ads manager and it's so fun. You know, we bond, you know, I tell them stories about the things that are happening in Bali, my challenges, how they could help me. And we're really building like a close connection and a close bond with the people that run my Facebook ads and Google ads um, with me as their clients, right? And this is something that you gotta take into consideration. If you wanna go ahead and find people that are where you wanna be, Sometimes you don't need a product. Sometimes you don't need anything other than to learn a certain marketing skill and help them to achieve their goals because that's how you literally build connections and networks. That's like how I did to like meet all of these people. You know, I have just like a marketing skill and we kind of like bonded because of that marketing skill that I acquired through years and years of practice. And that's why like this is literally an online job that you would enjoy because I'm telling you this right now, that skill that I've acquired, I'm still getting paid the benefits in just terms of just you know, a good life that happened from learning those skills. The next job that is really, really good is actually being a high ticket closer for people that are really successful. You could actually go to clickfunnels.com and then click on this search button and type in the word high ticket closer and there's people that have $3,000 to $10,000 products, they'll pay you 10 to 15% commission. Now this isn't like cold calling where, you know, I did this back in the day where you would have to call people like, hey, you wanna buy this? And they're like, screw you, never call me again. It's not like that at all. Because all these people, what these do, this is a group of marketers that create sales processes to get people who have no idea who they are to like, trust, and respect them, and love them, and buy from them. And many of the times, when you become a high ticket closer for anyone, like for example, the ClickFunnels group, these are already existing customers that already want to buy a product from these people that are creating these products and services, which makes the sale a lot more easier than in traditional like online or like just phone sales, right? And if you think about it, like I know people in Bali that just get on a couple of calls every other day and they make six figures on the side part time while still living their life, while still surfing, while still going out to parties, while still, you know, going out to networking events, training, going to the gym, going to, you know, jujitsu, right? They have all this free time and they actually enjoy it because they enjoy talking to people because it's in their icky guy. You know, the next one is becoming a copywriter. Copywriters are great. I, I enjoy copywriting because it's what allows me to sell my own products and services. But remember, if you do not want any risk at all and you wanna work with people that are a little bit further than you, kind of becoming a copywriter for them and learning how they copyright and how they sell their products is like the perfect breeding ground for your skills to just grow as an online entrepreneur. Which is why all of the best online jobs that I recommend are online jobs that are easy to transition you into entrepreneurship because then, in all honesty, that's what gives you the most free time and freedom in your life. And just doing all these side jobs and online jobs that are fun to do, because I've done them all, not only kind of like stacks skills into your repertoire, but also builds your confidence and builds your you know network as well. 
The next one is also being a freelance writer. You can see Pam making $100 an hour, and freelance writers are the people that we hire to help us build our blog, as you can see right here. We put a bunch of articles on our blog because of the fact that I know I'm gonna be heavily compensated for this when I rank on Google. So if you think about it, if one of these blog articles makes me, I don't know, $1,000 a month, right? Just $1,000 a month, right? How much would I be willing to spend for someone else to go ahead and create this blog article for me, right? Now you can see exactly how valuable writers become because of the fact that, number one, if you're a creative person, if you enjoy writing, and you could also enjoy writing about topics that you are enjoying about. They have real estate, they have finance, they have savings, they have you know health, they have wellness, they have all of these things that you could become a writer in. This is something you can do anywhere in the world. You already write about what you love doing and you get to see the inner workings of existing businesses. And the seventh one, which if all you want is the time freedom, and you're like, heck Mike, I don't like any one of these jobs. I just wanna go ahead and make money so that I can take all that freedom and do the things that I love to do. Then what I would recommend is affiliate marketing because it's exactly what these people were able to do to go from zero to $30,000 a month in five to eight weeks. Like Dean at age 47 and Greg at age 58 that I interview on my podcast. Podcast. And if you want to know exactly how they do it with the brand new method this year, then sign up for this free workshop below as well. As check out this video and this podcast right here. Hopefully, subscribe. Love you guys. See you guys later. Woo!